Hi loves, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to be doing four gift ideas for Mother's Day. So let's get started. Alright guys, so we have a basket which I called Mama's Chillax in Time. <laughs> we got some wine, we got some chocolates, our favorite movie, candles, and a blanket. I got this cute basket at Target. I thought it was really, really cute. I couldn't let it go and it was perfect for this idea. And plus, she could make a use off of it. <laughs> I'm going to add the crinkle paper into the basket. Now I'm just adding the blanket, the wine, just adding the stuff as I go and fixing it along the way. You know, can't forget mama's juice. I saw this citrus coconut candle at Target. It smells so good. And this one too from Bath and Body Works. Oh man, they smell really, really good. So why not throw it in there? <laughs> Also gotta have some mama's alone time favorite movies and some chocolate of course this is my favorite alone time movie now you can leave a basket like this I think it looks pretty you can also add in a basket gift bag this one actually was a little big for my idea but it did the job and so did the bow <laughs> On to our second idea. Unfortunately, it did not record as I was putting the stuff in the jar, but we got some chapstick, some cotton, nail polish, cuticle cream, candy, and some stickers that I got from Michaels, and some ribbon. I couldn't decide which ribbon to go with. So this is how it looks in the jar. And I'm adding the sticker on the top of the jar here. I think it looks best right there. And then I'm also adding another sticker in the front that says mom. No, sorry. This says love you mom. I think it was just really pretty. Now of course you can add whatever you want in these jars. I thought, jars, really? In these jars, I thought it was really, really cute. You know, simple, cute, and creative. On to our third gift idea. I called it Mama Loves Baking. I wouldn't mind having this basket actually because I love baking. <laughs> and I used the same basket and I saw these measuring cups and spoons. I had to get them from Walmart and it was so cute. So I'm adding the crinkle paper in the mitten and the spatulas. Now this spatula is cute. I had to get it. It said Mom's Fidget Spinner. <laughs> get it? Anyway, so I'm adding the stuff again as I go, and I think it looks pretty right there. And adding more cookie jars. I had to put the Texas one in the front because you know I live in Texas. <laughs> Here I'm just showing you putting it in the gift basket. You can do it again with or without the gift um bag, not basket, sorry. And this is the result of it. Onto our last one, which I believe is my favorite one because it's a little DIY and a little bit more detailed and more personal. I got this frame from Hobby Lobby. It was on sale for $10. Original price was $12. I got a great deal. So I took a picture and I printed out a picture of my sisters and I with a little note for my mom. Now you can leave the frame like this. It looks so pretty because it's white and the pictures have, you know, color. And these empty spots, I actually want to add the stickers in there because I like to add a little bit more extra stuff on my things. <laughs> so I'm just going to put it wherever I think it fits best. And don't forget to not move photos.
wow that looks really pretty you can leave it like this again or again we're adding a little bit more extra more is more <laughs> I'm gonna add these flowers around the frame here and I'm just gonna fix them how I think they look cute now you can probably add more flowers to this frame like actually fill in the whole frame but I actually think it came out really pretty So now I'm just going to hot glue them all over the frame. this is a result of it. I think it looks so pretty and gorgeous. Now I'm going to add a ribbon because I am not going to wrap it up in paper or a gift bag. I'm just going to put the ribbon on there. This is a result of it you guys happy mother's day to all the mamas out there i hope you guys enjoy these gift ideas and don't forget to subscribe i love you guys see you in the next one